All right, let's try that again. <coughs> so Is she's going to run up there. Made? Let's go ahead and quick save it here. I'm gonna send Abelard up. Is always there for you. Fate and fortune favor the bold. I am at your service. Victory is imminent. Your arrogance will be your downfall. I will right. take you down. Let's try it this way, Abelard. Get your duty up here. You, sir, let's get you over here. Argenta, I'm going to need you. Cassio, put you right there. Pascal. Zira, right here. That is foolishness. Oh, she, she doesn't have. Isn't this a job for the serfs? I am a navigator, not a servitor. All right, Pascal. Um, let's go ahead. Well, Job for the uh, we're gonna hold tight. We can put me front line there. Insist, Lord Captain. Oh, so that's all he can do? Lame. I gotta remember that the next time I try to use that ability. Because it's basically just hold in place and don't do anything. As the Emperor commands, I act. Here we go. Doubt is for the weak. As the Emperor commands, I act. Faith without deeds is worthless. I'll do it. This strike is a prayer. Okay. In thy light I stand, and thy light I crave. Doubt is for the weak. <laughs> As the Emperor commands, I act. Oh, really? Take it down, please. All right, it's better than nothing. All right, we have to use some grenades, I think. Shoot the barrels, use the grenades. I don't care if it hits him. Oh, he's got that ability on him right now. Very nice. I'm glad I triggered that last time, actually. Yet Iron knows no pain. 
Oh, Pascal. Guess what? Get up in here, bro. Alright, we're gonna do the intimidate. My vow is to serve. The Omnissiah knows all, comprehends all. The function successfully terminated. I don't mind because Pascal's about to do a big old AoE here in a minute when he gets his next turn. It's good stuff, man. I thought we were good. All right. Um. Anything let's do else? it. <laughs> she knocked Avalar down and also did some damage to Jay. That's just not very good. I don't need to lose her again. Within one cell radius. Was, was that you, or? He's as good as done. Didn't do what I wanted it to do. Pain and duty go hand in hand. Isn't this a job for the serfs? It's not what I wanted her to do, actually. If I may. I'm afraid not. Do not dare ask. I thought that was Abelard that I just sent up there and it was Cassian. This will be interesting to see if she gets taken out. She's choking me. Okay, we did get it. All right. Um. I'll do it. As the Emperor commands, I act. Okay. Got these. Oh, these guys shot their own boss. There's got to be a way for me to avoid her getting taken out. I'm going to finish the fight just to see if she's actually dead because I don't want to reload it again. I am going to finish the fight and see if she's truly dead or if she's just like dead for the fight and she revives after we finish because that is just ridiculous that she keeps taking friendly fire. Um, I am a savant of destruction. My competences are not that universal. Advancing. Running by their insignificant value. Yeah, there's no way to use like a health thing on her. It's like Stop it. How come Abelard hasn't had a turn in forever? 
I'll see to it personally. On it. There he goes. My place is at the fall. It will be done. An exemplary strike. I, my patience has failed me. I'll show you why navigators are feared. Indeed. Grey hair. That's sure the central's job. I will do my duty. I took care of this one. Can I not get over to that one? It will be done. Oh yeah, he can. He can charge him. One fewer target. It's good enough. All right, is she actually dead? Okay. So she's... I guess she's not actually... Fallen. So I probably didn't need to reload that first combat encounter. Because it says here, Jay, on your signal... Okay, 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 okay. So that was just weird how they actually had her, like, die in combat. Two, three, five. Thank you, Exalted Ones. Those aspects and to make up everything. Give me two minutes. I'll send the cords to my local crew who do deliver my property somewhere safe. And I'm done. Now we want to relocate to a more pleasant and private space to discuss the details of our deal, specific payment for your efforts. All right, let's go. She opens her mouth to reply when you hear the sound of many footsteps behind you. This is one of Vladimir's agents. Stop right there in the name of the liege. Then he sees me and falls to his knees. Your Excellency, please forgive my vehemence. I never expected to encounter such eminent persons in this corner. She goes, most noble Excellency. She shoots you a confused look. I am Vladimir, Vladimir Tokara's personal agent. I came here to remove from criminal circulation a shipment the distribution which is banned in the lands of footfall. Horrendous Xeno heresy. I do not doubt for a moment, most noble Renville, that your presence here is merely a misunderstanding brought about by other manipulations. Commerce has succeeded. It's too to great a coincidence that the Legion's representative should arrive in the Shadow Quarters just after Jay has recovered her rightful spoils. It seems that the guards reported the problems with the shipment over the Vox, not just to anyone, but to the Legion's personal agent. Vladimir Takara knew about the shipment, and from the start, and planned to take it for himself and get rid of Jay if he could. Behold, the grubby, underhanded struggle between, between cold traders. And had it not been for your impromptu deal struck at the bar, Vladimir might have succeeded. Oh, yeah. Jay Hadera, the owner of this cargo, is presently under my protection. Under a rogue trader's protection. Tell your master that he should think twice between crossing her before crossing her from now on. And don't forget to tell him I'm not mad, but I will be collecting the debt. Okay, cool. I wish I could see Vladimir's face when he found that he almost slipped on the toes of one of the most powerful person in the Expanse. I'm truly sorry about this confusion. My shipment contains Xeno artifacts, but you do not strike me as a commoner. Uh, I do hope this misunderstanding will not affect our future cooperation. Pascal says the statement is true with the exception that you yourself are an uneducated laywoman lay and a thief who ought to stay away from technological perversities. I am now requesting your preventative disposal. Uneducated? Me? Stop hiding beyond piety and law. Yes, yes! I would like to see you in my retinue. Oh, Abelard's all pissed off. Piss off yourself, Abelard.
When were you going to reveal your true identity to me? I am infinitely flattered by your attention, but had I known I was talking to a rogue trader, I would have shown some decorum. Oh, I wish we could forget decorum entirely in each other's presence. What a scandalous proposal! Scandalous and tantalizing. Yes! Of course! Alright. Perfect. If you're interested in a rather lucrative offer, one that I'd say that now is the time to think of such a once you get back to your ship, perhaps you could spare me a minute. Can I fall back now? Yes, who do I want to get rid of? I can get rid of Argenta, I think. Just until I see what class she is. All sorts Brace of stuff to loot here. Avalon. Ooh. Boots. Mesh vest. This could be an opportunity. What did you guys see? Ah, uh, goods over there. She's running all by herself over there. And one more over here in the corner. Okay, I do believe that is all of the goodies. And now we need to see what class. Peculiar thing. What did we just see? Other goods. So she's an officer. Oh. So that's similar to uh, Cassia. So maybe I don't need Cassia in my party. So I have Cassia spec as a grand st strategist. Hold up. What she's using is weapons. Oh, she dual wields pistols. Oh my god, that's so cool. And she has an Eldari chain sword. Oh my. Oh, what do we want to take you down as? Or is she already? I haven't found the grand strategist to be that useful so far. So why don't I... Can I take her as a master tactician? Yeah, why not? Inspire. the job hmm so 
Synonyms? <laughs> I don't really think that I like this archetype. Archetype, whatever. Should I just go Vanguard? No, that's definitely more of a tank thing. Am I really going to do another... I mean, the grand strategist is... Welcome to the channel, Eric Larson. Yeah, I'm just going to go tactician because I don't think any of my others... That's a strategist. You're a bounty hunter. You're an assassin, you're a vanguard, you're a bounty hero. Let's let's just go Let's go master tactician just to just why not? I'll figure it out. Assign objective. So technically, I probably should ditch Cassia, because I don't need two officers in my group. Although, she can do the Veil Degradation stuff. But I don't really use those many Psyker abilities anyway, except for Adira occasionally. I'll have to make some decisions about uh, my party management. Those are long-term decisions. I don't have to talk. I don't have to think about that tonight too much. I think we just took out the the Anvers too. Which technically, I wonder if they've gotten rid of the quarantine yet. Nope. Still taking his sweet time, isn't he? Welcome to Twitch, Asa Gray. Thanks for following along, all you new folks. Don't forget we're multi-streaming. YouTube and Twitch, you can pick your poison. It's pretty awesome so far, Asa. I like it. I've got a video up on YouTube called My f my uh, First Thoughts that I put out, I think, yesterday or the I day before. Keep my options open. Talking a lot about uh, what we're doing here with Rogue Trader. I think we're going to go straight to the Lieges residence. I think we can turn in that Anvers quest. If not, we'll just head back to the ship. pretty amazing the amount of detail they put into this game um, somebody was here earlier wanting to talk about you know how does this compare to Baldur's Gate 3 and it's like it's it's you don't don't compare it to Baldur's Gate 3 it's not the same it's not the same thing I find way too many people are obsessed right now with like if it doesn't have all the voice if it doesn't have the same amount of voiceovers or the same amount of... Welcome to YouTube, Natalie. Um, a lot of people are like, if it doesn't have the same amount of voiceovers, the same amount of voice acting, the same amount of motion capture, the same amount of this, that, or the other, if it doesn't have all the same things that Baldur's Gate 3 has, it's not worth playing. And it's like, fuck off with that bullshit. Like, Baldur's Gate 3 had like a $150 million budget. 
Rogue Trader had a few million dollar budget. There's a big difference in terms of scope of what I you can do. Have a backup plan. It's totally disingenuous to try to prop all games up against Baldur's Gate 3 right now. Our deal is still in place. <laughs> Told you I'd find a better deal, Jay. All right, Vladim's not happy about that. Uh, show some respect. She's my new business partner. Certainty, Lordship. I apologize for my lack of manners. I was unprepared for this development. A man who introduced himself as a servant of House Chorda asked to have a word with me, and then imagine the odds someone blew his brains out. The Anvers again, I presume? It was. Hmm. Certainly I'm one person who stood to gain from that murder. Ah, I vociferously deny anything of the sort. However, if you're merely alluding to the possibility that someone who cares about footfall's fate could have started a rumor. All right. Any questions? Who holds the reins of the Xeno goods trade? What oath are you referring to? Huh. A fascinating custom. Something tells me he used to be a bit of a bandit. Much has become clear. Alright, no more questions. Let's get out of here. Acid Grey looks great for that budget, and they worked on Baldur's Gate 3 and Alpha for a very long time. Yeah, I mean, they had many years, three years. Everybody runs on autopilot, says Babylonia. It's not wrong, you're not wrong. I mean... One of these days, we'll get folks that are a little more conscious about uh, using their brains. Alright, I think, to be honest with you, if I'm not mistaken about all of my quests... Oh, my alarm's going off. Alright, so everything else I think that we have is back on the bridge of my ship. So that's a good enough place to head. Um, but that's also a good place for me to wrap up tonight, everybody. My alarm just went off, so that's my two-hour mark. So I'm going to head out from here. I'll be back tomorrow morning, 5.30 a.m., bright and early, as we always do. Tomorrow morning, more Rogue Trader. Tomorrow night, however, will be World of Warcraft. We're going to be doing some dungeon runs with the guild tomorrow night. If you want to come join us in World of Warcraft, we are on the Moonguard server. You can hit me up directly in Discord if you want to come join us. I can get you a link to our guild discord. Um, I'm probably going to do some, like, I'm probably going to do a couple more first impressions videos and discussions on Rogue Trader soon. I've got three guides coming out. I've got the class guide coming out tomorrow, and then two additional guides coming out of that, and then i got still got to do my ultimate uh, beginner's guide to character creation. Um, that'll probably add on today's Today, Tuesday? So I've got Wednesday, Thursday, Friday videos already recorded. I need to record a Saturday video. Um, and then I think I'll be done with the initial guides. And I'm going to start to work on like my build, my build guides for this character. Um, because I've been having a lot of fun with my marksman it's a soldier now but i feel like i misspect i feel like i totally spec adira wrong and I, I don't know if you can respec or not i'm not happy with her having chosen the assassin um it's not that big of a deal but i need to switch her out from using melee weapons 
Or just she needs to get up close and personal in combat instead of being back in the back. I'm going to play around with her some more as I work this out and continue learning. Because I'm still learning this game quite a bit. So, yeah. Um, Save Babylonia. Asset, you're welcome. Asset, also, if you're, if you're wanting to know more about the game, if you go over to my YouTube channel, I know you're on Twitch right now, but... Um, over on YouTube, I've got a video. As soon as you hit my YouTube channel, it's the it's the video that all new people see. But it's called my my early thoughts on Rogue Trader. So if you want to know more about this game and if you're wanting some more insight into it, that's a good like 15. I think it's like 15 minutes long or something of me talking about all my early thoughts on Rogue Trader, um, which is more than what you're gonna get from just watching the stream because that actually is like you know culmination of. This is how combat is, this is how the voice acting is, this is how this is. Um, so if you want to know more about it, check that out. But everybody else, I'll see you guys in the morning. Bright and early, 5.30 a.m. Central. Peace!